Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Election day today, baby. Don't forget to vote. Let me tell you what you're going to do today. This is what we're going to do today at the booth. Let me tell you what we're going to do today at the booth. The election booth. We're going to take the ballot. And then right down where it says you can write in somebody's name. All right. We're going to check that box. We're going to get our pen. We're going to ghost picks Benny that's what we're gonna do today that's what we're gonna do today Benny for president baby Benny for mayor Benny for governor Benny for the people let's rip <coughs> Benny here ghostpicksats.com the number one sports consultant in the business Tuesday November 7th and then make sure after you write ghost picks Benny in you go get some pork and sauerkraut. That's how we go. Let's go. Um, I have an election day special up right now. It's a 2023 close out special, which I'm running today and I'm going to run it today only now. $249.99 for the rest of 2023. There are exactly 55 days left in 2023, including today. So it's $249.99. And that's damn near two months uh, for two fifty. Okay, comes down to about one twenty five a month. Comes, I, I did the math on it. It's exactly four dollars and fifty four cents a day. All sports, all plays. Now that is Benny for the people. That is why you vote for Benny on election day. So deal expires at midnight tonight. No if and or. Butts. And I have it pinned right here to the top of the comment section. Two for Tuesdays up as well. Top tier plays. Any two handicappers you choose, make sure you select Benny as one of your handicappers. And then if you want to jump on, I will have a top tier play today. And if you want to jump on my full week this week, okay, $79.99. And I am going to run it today, which is Tuesday until Monday. So it is going to be the full seven day week and it's going to be $79 and 99 cents. I'm still eyeing up a possible another big play. Okay. It felt really good hitting that big play on the Bengals on Sunday. For real, for real. I know it was not an official red alert, but I treated it like a red alert, you know? So I felt really good to cash in on that. There've been, I know I haven't had a red alert in a while. There have been a lot of other red alerts and games of the week and all that other stuff that we have five different cappers. So like everybody's doing game of the week, game of the year, get a red alert. So yeah, you know, like, so uh, it, it, sometimes it's hard to squeeze in there. So yeah, it felt good. But yeah, it felt good to hit that on Sunday night. I really am looking at doing it again this week, whether it's an official red alert or not game of the week but if i'm running a big play or if i'm an, a, a, announcing a big play just know that we are treating it like a big play no matter what no matter what i call it big shouts to everybody who cashed in on it with me monday i did not follow up too well my free plays hit again i free play i'm on a free play heater right now for sure without a doubt on tiktok and on youtube and on blog i was on the jets um chargers under 41 right here on YouTube. Uh, we didn't even really have to uh, hold our breath on that one. We did not have to hold our breath. Maybe toward the end of the game, kind of, but nah, went well well under 41. And then I had a free play winner on the Pacers minus nine on TikTok and on the blog. And that was also a rocking chair free play winner over on TikTok. Now, on the premium card, I was on the Jets. So I took a loss on Monday Night Football. Puts me at 50, 21, and 2 now on the NFL season, which is still really fire overall. We'll leave it at that. College basketball started yesterday, and I went 0-2. Oh and two. and I, I guess I wasn't ready or something, okay? Rutgers minus 5.5 lost, and then Virginia Tarleton under 124.5 also lost. Early in college hoops. You know my motto. We kind of ease into new seasons. Nothing crazy to start. I'm not worried about college basketball at all. I'm not worried about that at all. I'll have more NCAA uh, AA basketball action today. Yesterday, I lost on the Magic Moneyline and NBA. I had a winner on Lightning Leafs over six and a half. 
in hockey. My hockey is starting to really pick back up. And then I hit a nice plus 134 on Chelsea money line draw no bet in soccer. So I went two and three overall on my premium card. We had the nice plus money cash in soccer, another two and zero oh on free plays. And if I were a betting man, I oh, were a betting man. I'd bet that we're going to bounce back today on the premium card. For sure. If you're new to my page, welcome. Take a second out of your day. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Tap the bell. You get my video every single time it pops up. And then follow me along over on Twitter as well, at Benny Bistro. And most importantly, thumbs up in the video. You got to do the boop. You got you to gotta subscribe, boop, tap the bell, boop, and then tap the thumbs up. Boop. It's the triple boop, okay? Now, shout out of the day. Chargers, minus three and a half and under 41. I'm honestly shocked at how many people were on the Jets with me yesterday. I did not expect that. Uh, a lot of people in the comments on the Jets, so I was not alone on that. And then most folks that took the Chargers took the over 41. Jets were truly atrocious last night. I was hyped for the Jets. Major letdown, again, by that offense. Zach Wilson, ugh. U-G-G-G-G-G-G-H-H-H-H-H-H, ugh. How about that? Shout out to the day, Des Chase Song got it right. Des Chase on and Russ Fike. Only two who got it right. Only two who nailed it. You're my shout out of the day today. I don't know what's going on with NBA lines right now, but my fan, but if Fandle put them up early and then they immediately took them down, DraftKings never put them out from what I saw. But I've been checking, I don't know if it's me or what, but like I've been checking like every five minutes like a freaking idiot and still no lines. So how about we switch it up today and hit some NHL for shout out of the day. Let's guess the correct outcome in the NHL. Dead even money line odds. Okay, 9.08 p.m. Eastern Time. Seattle cracking at the Arizona Coyotes. Both are minus 110 on the money line. So we're going to uh, go guess the correct outcome. Kraken money line and over six and a half. Kraken money line and under six and a half. The Coyotes money line and over six and a half. Coyotes money line and under six and a half. Let's go with that. NBA, I'll have on my TikTok when lines come out. Tuesday's in, uh, in season tournament day too. So I'm waiting. I've been waiting. So as soon as I see the lines, I'll have a free play on TikTok in the NBA. I was already eyeing one up. But I want to make sure the line, uh, the line's official and I'll have a video out on TikTok as well. But today, right here on YouTube, we're going college football. 7 p.m. Eastern time, Ball State at Northern Illinois. Very exciting. Free play of the day. Northern Illinois minus 10. This might be nine and, nine and a half on Fandle. If it is, obviously take that. Fandle earlier kept saying that they had an issue and they were down for maintenance to resolve the issue. But make sure to check on their Twitter page to stay up to date and all that. And then I started thinking, like, I ain't got time for that. I hop on over to DraftKings. Northern Illinois, minus 10. Neither of these teams are really that good. But Ball State has been at the bottom of the bottom. Right, two and seven overall, one and four in conference play. Northern Illinois is three and two in conference play, and they've been a little bit better. Now they're coming off a loss last week to Central Michigan, and I expect them to bounce back here today against Ball State at home. Okay, Ball State just lost a close one. Now they had a close one to Bowling Green, but they've been pretty darn bad overall. One and five the last six games. They're zero and seven their last seven on the road. Like I said uh, before, I can't really just sit here and gap up Northern Illinois much either. I really can't. But I think Northern Illinois is better defensively and offensively, I would say. Just overall. Okay? And they're at home. If you look, their numbers at home against the spread are not good. You're not going to find good numbers there. But I still give the advantage to NIU. 10 is a lot. I'm going to lay 10. Free play today, Northern Illinois, minus 10. Vote for Benny. Vote for Benny. Vote for Benny at the booth today. Okay? Election Day special. Now, it's now until the end of the year. December 31st, 2023. So it's 55 days of plays. $249.99. All sports. All plays. So it goes to four dollars and fifty-four cents a day. Big plays included. 
and it's up for today only. And I'll continue to put in the work. The deal expires um, at midnight tonight. And then it's off the table. Full week special, $79.99. I will extend that till Monday. Tuesday to Monday. So it is a full week. And then two for Tuesday, $19.99. Top tier plays. Any two handicappers you choose. Select Benny as your handicapper. Waldo looking mofo. As always, good luck. God bless. Right on, baby. Cheers.